Hey, what's going on? Um, just wanted to make a quick video of a gadget I just picked up not too long ago. Um, it's a UMPC Sony Vio VGN uh, UX280P. Um, I'm pretty new to like uh, UMPCs, but I mean it's pretty decent. I wouldn't say it's like you know a gaming machine or anything like that but for the form factor I mean this thing could basically fit in your pocket it's pretty cool because it does basically everything a, a normal laptop does in this small uh, form factor I know the hard drive is like um 40 gig hard drive I think let me, let me check hey why we can't see that come on camera focus there we go um, it's like a 40 gig hard drive. It comes with a stylus, which is here. Uh, let me just click on my computer. I'm not sure if you guys can see that. Oh, there we go. Um, it's a 40 gig hard drive, I think. Yeah. Um, <clears throat> I did some a little bit of modifications to it. Um, now, for some reason, it says it has Bluetooth. And um, if you look down here you see the blue light and the that's that's the Bluetooth and that's for the Wi-Fi but for some reason the Bluetooth I guess module inside is not <coughs> is not working even though I, I installed the drivers and everything now I originally bought this off of eBay for about I think four or five hundred dollars and the guy said that um there was something wrong with it so I brought it anyway and um there is an issue with the screen if you press as you can see if you press on the bezel <coughs> excuse me if you press on the bezel you see it does that but if you just press it it'll go away so i mean that doesn't take away the functionality of the screen because everything still works um <coughs> it does have a slotted keyboard which is backlit which is great but the keyboard is crappy like there's no tactile feedback like You'll be, you know, they, these things are so candy, like these little chiclets. You'll press this and you'll be pressing that at the same time. So that that was like a waste. I wish there was a way to change this to make it a better experience. Um, I know you have like a Vio button, which I think brings up like a quick Vio menu when you can change. Let's see if I change the brightness of that makes it oh yeah it does make it a little bit better there so um i did i did hook it up to my tv and the vga does work um what i did was i basically restored the computer i bought a uh, external dvd drive and just restored it and because at first when i first booted it up it didn't it, like it just kept like uh boot looping and it, it didn't work so um I just basically re reinstalled the Windows, and um, voila, everything works. Um, <clears throat> I did manage to overclock it because I know it comes with a Core Solo, like 1.2, but I overclocked it to like 1.4, which makes it. You wouldn't think a 200 megahertz will make a difference, and it really does. This thing makes like a hell of a difference. Let me see if I can focus there. Come on, there we go. See, it's normally at 1.2 there, but once you set the um, set, uh, front side bus to like 252, you can get like 14. But if you go anywhere over that, it's going to uh, crack. You're going to get a blue screen because I tried already. I mean, you can probably go up like maybe two or three more, but that's about it. Um, also downloaded um, GMA Booster, which... Uh, um, overclocks the GPU to uh, from 200 megahertz to 400 megahertz, which also makes a world of a difference. As you can see there, if this thing freaking focus, it's at four. But you can see it; it's at four. Um, now I try to d download like maybe a few games that will run on it, something like Far Cry, Silent Hill, of course, Bejeweled, um, the PlayStation One emulator. Halo and I just downloaded uh, Fear. Um, now, this uh, Far Cry works on here pretty well. Let's see if I can load it up. Now you gotta 
You gotta excuse me because this is not the fastest hard drive in the world and it does take some time to load. But it works pretty well and you can actually run... Uh oh. Hmm. Isn't that something? <laughs> That's Windows for you. Oh, I guess we can't see that one. But um, Silent Hill works at max settings. Far Cry works like some things at max, some things not. Halo works everything maxed. Let's see if we can actually play Halo. This works everything max. I don't know why they think it's on my. I know I was playing it earlier, so I'll just put uh, continue. Oh, great. You can't see anything. Uh, let me go back and see if I can choose a level. Uh, let's go back. Oh, that's right. You can't. I don't think that works. I'm just trying to basically show you uh, like what kind of frame rates you can get out of um, like overclocking and this stuff. Uh, let's go to the first stage. What the hell is this? Why can't I go down? Oh lord. Oh, there it is. Let's try this stage. I know it's locked. Hmm. Well, I don't want to make this video too long. What am I doing here? Okay, there we go. Now, I will record this with my um, camcorder that has a tripod, but that thing has, like, crappy quality. Now, let's see if we can get past this. Yeah, and that's the only thing, another thing that's like kind of bad about this, uh, well, let me see if this is all on max settings, it should be though. Another bad thing about this, um, this UMPC is the speaker quality is basically non-existent. Uh, see, actually all the settings was off. Speaker quality is like non-existent. I mean, it's so low and it's not even funny. Let me see if I bumped it. Yeah, I should be able to put it there. Now, can I press? Can I press right here? Where did the mouse go? Oh, there it is. Now I will tell you, overclocking it does make it heat up quite a bit, so, you know, I don't know what that does to the, um, Chief, please look around the room. you know, I need to get a calibration for your if that, that's going to harm it in the, in the near future, so, I wouldn't say overclock all the time. Good. Thank you, sir. I'm bringing your health monitor to our line, sir. Yeah, that looks a little better. Now, I'm going to... I'm going to install uh, okay, Fear, so Fear, and see how that looks on here. I might make a video of that. Anyway, you get pretty good. I mean, you get decent fr frame rate out of this game at, at max settings. So, you know, but it's Halo, so it's like the first Halo. So it's not like a graphical intense game. So anyway, um, now I did purchase the extended battery, which is here. I originally bought a battery off of eBay, one of those cheap Chinese batteries that's like not a genuine Sony battery. They give you like a, <coughs> a software CD that you put in here that tries to patch the BIOS in order to trick it to, you know, think that the, the um, fake battery is a Sony battery. Don't waste your money on those, even though they're cheap, they don't work. Trust me, it, it it's a pain to even try to 
download the software from their server and you got to email them this and they never respond back and I had to send that back and get my money back for that so I just went back on eBay and got a, um an extended battery for like 95 bucks and um it, it does last a long time because I charged it today was like the first time I charged it and um I mean I, I just had it on all day and I'm just now plugging it back up so and it still probably had juice in it when I plugged it back up because it would it was at a hundred percent and I, I used it all day so um anyway <clears throat> I just wanted to make a quick video of my UMPC and I don't know why this is not exit we want to exit okay there we go but if you um you know if, if there's anything I'm left out that you guys want to see about the unit you know just leave a comment or something like that and I'll try my best to uh take care of anyone's requests I know that this thing has like a one of those old singular wireless modules here on this side but it doesn't I don't even think that thing works so anyway um like I said it's a pretty decent system you know um I'll probably be just tethering my phone to this and um you know uh use it for um oh that's pretty cool I forgot I had that in here <laughs> you have like f cube effect there anyway I probably just tethered my phone because I'm gonna be going on the road as of Saturday I'm a truck driver so just tether my phone and go on the net when I'm in the truck sleeping and just being on the net or something but anyway um, you know if you like the video like subscribe comment whatever um, I'm about to do a PS Vita video for um, Shine Mora I think that's the name of the game should be the name that game's pretty good I got it on my PC so I'll make a video of that <coughs> if you want to see what uh, the Far Cry I can get Far Cry to work that's not a problem if you want to see what Far Cry looks like or if you want to see what the Silent Hill looks like or the fear just let me know and I'll make a video so other than that peace out